Turns out there are communities around the world called blue zones that may have found the secret to living a long and healthy life. Ever wondered if the fountain of youth was not a myth, but a reality hidden in the daily lives of some extraordinary communities? Activity for the centenarians is very important. From the serene valleys of Pakistan to the tranquil islands of Japan, join us as we uncover the secrets of people who live to see over a century healthy and hearty. The Hunza Phenomenon In the remote, mountainous regions of northern Pakistan lies a valley that seems to hold the secrets to longevity and vitality. The Hunza people residing here are known for their incredible lifespan, with many living up to 120 years and beyond. But what is it about the Hunza lifestyle that contributes to their remarkable longevity? At the heart of the Hunza phenomenon is their diet. Predominantly plant-based, it is rich in apricots, vegetables, grains, and nuts. Hunza apricots are especially famous. They're not just a staple, but a superfood packed with vitamins, fiber, and antioxidants. The Hunzakuts consume apricots in various forms, dried, as jam, or as oil, making it a critical component of their daily nutrition. Their diet is low in protein, fat, and carbohydrates, but high in minerals and vitamins, providing them with all the necessary nutrients without the burden of processed foods. The purity of their food is ensured through organic farming methods. Hunzakuts grow their own food without the use of synthetic pesticides or fertilizers, this connection with the land not only guarantees a fresh supply of organic produce, but also embeds physical activity into their daily routine, contributing to their overall health and longevity. Physical activity is not a scheduled part of their day, but an intrinsic one. The rugged terrain requires the Hunzakuts to engage in constant physical labor, be it farming, herding, or simply traversing the steep landscape. This consistent physical activity ensures a high level of fitness among all age groups, contributing significantly to their extended health span. An interesting aspect of the Hunza lifestyle is their practice of seasonal fasting. Before the summer harvest, when food supplies run low, Hunza kuts undergo a period of fasting, consuming only a light broth. This practice, akin to intermittent fasting, is now recognized for its health benefits, including improved metabolic health, increased longevity, and reduced disease risk. The Hunza Valley is not just a place of physical health, but mental well-being, too. The community life in Hunza is characterized by strong social ties and a deep sense of belonging. Stress, known to be a significant factor in reducing lifespan, is remarkably low. Their simple lifestyle, close-knit community, and the serene environment contribute to a stress-free existence. The Hunza Valley, with its pristine environment, clean air, and mineral-rich water, plays a crucial role in the health of its inhabitants. The water, in particular, is rich in minerals due to its journey through the mountainous terrain, providing Hunzakuts with essential nutrients naturally. Despite their isolation, the Hunza people are not devoid of health care. They possess a rich tradition of herbal remedies, passed down through generations, which they use to treat various ailments. This knowledge, combined with their healthy lifestyle, reduces their reliance on modern medicine. Ecuador's Vilcabambans, a fountain of youth nestled in the serene Andes Mountains of Ecuador, lies a small village that has captivated the world's imagination as a real-life Shangri-La. Vilcabamba, often referred to as the Valley of Longevity, is home to an extraordinary number of centenarians, individuals who have crossed the 100-year mark with grace. The secrets to their prolonged life expectancy are a blend of diet, the purity of their environment, and a lifestyle that promotes physical activity. The diet of the Vilcabambans plays a crucial role in their longevity. It is primarily plant-based, consisting of locally grown organic fruits and vegetables, legumes, and grains. This diet is low in processed foods and sugars, but high in fiber, antioxidants, and essential nutrients, which are key to maintaining health and preventing diseases. Corn, potatoes, beans, and a variety of fruits form the staple of their meals. 
The absence of industrialized food means lower consumption of unhealthy fats and chemicals, contributing significantly to their overall health. One cannot overlook the importance of the local produce that thrives in mineral-rich soil. This contributes not only to the nutritional value of the food, but also to its ability to enhance the longevity of those who consume it regularly. Perhaps one of the most compelling secrets to the health of the Vilcabambans is the water they drink. Originating from the untouched peaks of the Andes, the water in Vilcabamba is naturally filtered and infused with minerals. Researchers speculate that this mineral-rich water contributes significantly to the health and longevity of the local population by naturally detoxifying the body and providing essential minerals that are lacking in most modern diets. Physical activity is an inherent part of daily life in Vilcabamba. The villagers engage in regular physical labor, whether it's farming, walking long distances, or simply performing daily chores, all of which contribute to their physical well-being. This constant, natural physical activity ensures cardiovascular health, flexibility, and muscle strength, which are crucial for longevity. Moreover, the geography of Vilcabamba encourages outdoor activities. The mountainous terrain and the lush surroundings invite hiking, horseback riding, and walking, seamlessly integrating exercise into daily life without the need for structured fitness routines. The social structure of Vilcabamba also plays a pivotal role in its inhabitants' longevity. The tight-knit community supports each other, providing a strong social network that is vital for mental health. This sense of belonging and purpose contributes to a lower stress level among the Vilcabambans. Stress, a known factor in aging and health problems, is significantly reduced in this environment. The pace of life is slow and deliberate, allowing residents to live in the moment and enjoy a sense of peace and well-being that is rare in the fast-paced modern world. The pristine environment of Vilcabamba, free from pollution and the hustle of urban life, contributes to the health of its residents. The clean air and the tranquility of nature serve as a natural therapy, enhancing both mental and physical health. Traditional medicine, using herbs and plants found in the surrounding area, remains a vital aspect of healthcare. This knowledge, passed down through generations, complements their lifestyle and diet, providing natural remedies for various ailments. Okinawan Secrets to a Century of Life Okinawa, a picturesque archipelago in Japan, has long been the subject of fascination and study due to its high number of centenarians and the overall health of its population. This unique longevity has been attributed to a combination of factors, including diet, lifestyle, and social structure, which have been examined and revered by scientists and laypeople alike. Central to the Okinawan secret of longevity is their diet, often described as low in calories but dense in nutrients. It is predominantly plant-based, rich in sweet potatoes, green and yellow vegetables, soy products like tofu, and an abundance of fruits. This dietary regimen is complemented by a moderate intake of fish, providing essential omega-3 fatty acids and minimal consumption of meat and dairy products. Such a diet is low in saturated fats and high in antioxidants and phytonutrients, which are critical in combating oxidative stress and inflammation, key factors in aging and disease. <laughs> The concept of hara hachi bu is another dietary practice that contributes to their longevity. This Confucian teaching advises eating until one is 80% full, promoting calorie restriction without malnutrition. Scientific studies have linked calorie restriction to increased lifespan and reduced risk of chronic diseases. Okinawans lead an inherently active lifestyle that integrates physical activity into daily routines. Gardening, walking, and traditional practices like Tai Chi are commonplace, contributing to their cardiovascular health and mobility. This constant, low-intensity physical activity is sustainable and has profound benefits on longevity by maintaining metabolic health and reducing the risk of chronic diseases. The social fabric of Okinawa is characterized by strong community ties and an emphasis on social participation, regardless of age. The traditional Okinawan moai, a social support network plays a crucial role in providing emotional and financial support among its members. These close-knit communities ensure that no one feels isolated, reducing stress, 
and promoting mental health. Moreover, the Okinawan culture values respect for the elderly, integrating them into the community and recognizing their role in society. This sense of purpose and belonging contributes to their mental well-being and is a vital component of their longevity. While lifestyle and diet play significant roles, the natural environment and genetic makeup of the Okinawans also contribute to their longevity. The subtropical climate promotes outdoor activities, and the relative isolation of the islands may have led to genetic factors favorable to longevity. However, the lifestyle choices remain the primary drivers that other populations can emulate. Okinawa has been the subject of numerous scientific studies aimed at understanding the secrets behind its residents' longevity. Research has highlighted the Okinawan diet's role in reducing the risk of heart disease, stroke, cancer, and diabetes. The low-calorie, nutrient-rich diet, along with regular physical activity, contributes to low body mass index, BMI, and minimal obesity rates, factors closely linked with extended lifespan. Studies have also focused on the Okinawan attitude towards life, including their stress-reducing practices and strong community bonds. These psychosocial factors are increasingly recognized as critical components of longevity. While the Okinawan lifestyle might seem distant and difficult to replicate in fast-paced modern societies, its principles offer valuable lessons. Incorporating more plant-based foods into the diet, practicing portion control, integrating physical activity into daily life, and fostering strong community ties can contribute significantly to improving health and extending lifespan. Sardinia's Centenarian Code Sardinia, an enchanting island in the Mediterranean Sea, harbors one of the world's highest concentrations of centenarians, particularly in the rugged mountainous region of Barbagia. This demographic anomaly has drawn researchers and curious minds alike to uncover the secrets behind the remarkable longevity of its inhabitants. The Sardinian Centenarian Code is a complex interplay of diet, lifestyle, genetic factors, and social structure, echoing some similarities with other longevity hotspots while retaining unique elements. Central to Sardinian longevity is their traditional Mediterranean diet, known for its health benefits and its role in preventing diseases. The diet is predominantly plant-based, featuring whole grains, legumes, vegetables, fruits, nuts, and a significant intake of olive oil, a source of healthy fats. Sardinians also consume a moderate amount of dairy products, particularly cheese from grass-fed sheep, which is high in omega-3 fatty acids. The consumption of lean meat and fish is limited but present, ensuring a balanced intake of proteins. Wine, particularly the local red variety known for its high levels of antioxidants, is consumed in moderation. These dietary habits contribute to a low prevalence of heart disease, obesity, and diabetes, common ailments in Western societies. Physical activity is woven into the fabric of daily life in Sardinia, much like in other longevity zones. The mountainous terrain necessitates walking and shepherding, providing natural cardiovascular benefits. Farming, another common occupation, requires physical labor, ensuring that Sardinians remain active throughout their lives. This lifestyle contrasts with the sedentary habits of modern urban living, underscoring the importance of regular, moderate exercise in longevity. The social structure in Sardinia, particularly in Barbagia, is characterized by strong family ties and community networks. The concept of family extends beyond the nuclear model, encompassing a wide network of relations who provide support and companionship. This social cohesion is a critical factor in mental health, reducing stress and promoting a sense of belonging and purpose. Elderly Sardinians are respected and remain integrated within the community, contributing to their sense of worth and reducing feelings of loneliness and depression, common issues in Western societies that affect both mental and physical health. Research has indicated that genetics, coupled with environmental factors, plays a role in Sardinian longevity. The genetic isolation and homogeneity of the population have contributed to a gene pool that may be predisposed to longevity. However, it is the synergy between these genetic predispositions and lifestyle factors that truly defines the Sardinian longevity phenomenon. 
Sardinia shares several commonalities with other longevity zones, such as a plant-based diet, high physical activity levels, strong community bonds, and respect for the elderly. However, the emphasis on dairy products, particularly cheese, sets it apart from the predominantly fish-based protein intake in Okinawa or the legume-heavy diet of the Hunza Valley. Moreover, the cultural significance of wine in Sardinia, consumed in moderation, adds a unique aspect to their dietary habits, reflecting the broader Mediterranean lifestyle. The genetic aspect of Sardinian longevity also offers a distinct angle, suggesting that while lifestyle is paramount, genetic predispositions cannot be entirely overlooked. Ikaria, Greece's island of long life. Ikaria, a picturesque island in the Aegean Sea, stands out as a remarkable example of longevity, where the inhabitants live significantly longer than average, often surpassing 100 years. This island of long life captivates those seeking the secrets behind its residents' extended lifespans, attributed to a blend of dietary habits, lifestyle, and social structures. At the core of Icarian longevity is the Mediterranean diet, renowned for its health benefits. Icarians consume a diet rich in vegetables, legumes, fruits, whole grains, and olive oil, with a minimal intake of processed foods and meats. Their meals are seasoned with a variety of local herbs, which are not only flavor enhancers, but also possess potent antioxidant properties. A distinctive aspect of the Icarian diet is the consumption of local honey, a natural sweetener known for its health benefits, and herbal teas made from wild plants, which are believed to have diuretic and blood pressure lowering effects. Fish is eaten in moderation, providing the essential omega-3 fatty acids beneficial for heart health. This dietary pattern, low in saturated fats and high in fiber and antioxidants, contributes to the low incidence of cardiovascular diseases and other chronic conditions commonly seen in the Western world. Physical activity in Ikaria is not a scheduled part of the day, but an intrinsic one, much like in other longevity zones. The island's terrain encourages walking, tending to gardens, and farming, ensuring that Icarians maintain a naturally active lifestyle. This integration of physical activity helps in maintaining a healthy weight, reducing the risk of chronic diseases, and promoting overall well-being. The social structure in Ikaria plays a crucial role in its inhabitants' longevity. Ikarians enjoy strong community ties, with a culture that emphasizes social interaction and support. Regular social gatherings, community festivals, and a general sense of belonging contribute to their mental and emotional well-being effectively combating stress and isolation, known factors in premature aging and health decline. It soon becomes obvious that these are people who maximize social engagement. The concept of time in Ikaria also differs significantly from the rest of the world. Life moves at a slower pace, allowing residents to live stress-free lives with lower levels of anxiety and depression. This relaxed pace of life alongside afternoon naps, which are a common practice, contributes to reduced stress levels and better heart health. Ikaria's environment, with its clean air and the Mediterranean climate, contributes to the health of its residents. The lifestyle on the island, which combines physical activity, healthy eating, and strong social networks, creates a holistic approach to well-being. Similar to other longevity hotspots, Ikaria emphasizes a plant-based diet, physical activity, and strong social connections. However, the Ikarian diet stands out for its use of local honey and herbal teas, reflecting the island's unique flora. The social fabric of Ikaria, with its emphasis on community and a slower pace of life, also sets it apart, highlighting the importance of mental and emotional health in longevity. Calabria, Italy's ageless village. Nestled in the southern toe of Italy's boot, Calabria is home to villages that seem to defy the modern age, where the concept of longevity takes on a new meaning. This region, with its ageless villagers, offers profound insights into a lifestyle that promotes health and longevity, focusing on diet, physical labor, and the indispensable strength of family ties. The cornerstone of Calabrian longevity is its adherence to the Mediterranean diet, characterized by a high consumption of vegetables, fruits, legumes, whole grains, and olive oil. 
Olive oil, in particular, is a staple in Calabrian cuisine, used generously to dress salads and cook meals. It's rich in monounsaturated fats and antioxidants, contributing to heart health and reducing the risk of chronic diseases. Calabrians also consume a significant amount of fish, providing essential omega-3 fatty acids. Their diet is complemented by a moderate intake of wine, particularly red, which is consumed with meals and is known for its cardiovascular benefits. Unlike the heavier reliance on dairy and Sardinia, Calabria's diet leans more towards plant-based protein sources, such as legumes, which are integral to their meals. Physical activity in Calabria is not a chore but a part of daily life. The region's rugged terrain and agricultural tradition mean that many Calabrians engage in farming, cultivating their land, and tending to livestock. This lifestyle ensures that physical labor, from planting and harvesting to walking the steep paths between fields, is a natural part of their routine. Such constant, moderate exercise is crucial for maintaining cardiovascular health and a balanced weight, contributing significantly to the region's longevity rates. Perhaps one of the most distinctive aspects of Calabrian longevity is the profound importance of family. In Calabrian society, family extends beyond the nuclear unit, creating a broad network of support that includes immediate and extended family members. These strong familial bonds provide emotional support, reduce stress, and contribute to a sense of belonging and happiness. Family gatherings, especially around meals, are common and serve as an essential element of social life. These interactions not only reinforce family ties, but also ensure that elderly family members are integrated, respected, and cared for, reducing the risks of loneliness and depression, which can significantly impact health and longevity. The Calabrian environment, with its clean air, moderate climate, and natural landscapes, complements the lifestyle of its inhabitants. The blend of physical activity, a healthy diet, and robust social structures creates a synergy that promotes longevity. While Calabria shares the Mediterranean diet's core components with other regions like Sardinia and Icaria, its unique emphasis on family as the social fabric sets it apart. The natural integration of physical labor into daily life also distinguishes Calabria, highlighting a lifestyle that remains closely tied to the land. Loma Linda – Modern Longevity in Practice Loma Linda, California is a remarkable exception in the United States, known for its significant population of Seventh-day Adventists and their notably longer lifespans compared to the national average. This community offers a contemporary case study in longevity, largely attributed to lifestyle choices deeply rooted in religious beliefs. These choices include a plant-based diet, regular physical activity, abstention from smoking and alcohol, and a strong sense of community and purpose. Central to the Seventh-day Adventist lifestyle is a predominantly plant-based diet, recommended by their faith to maintain physical and mental health. This diet is rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, nuts, and legumes, with many adherents choosing to be vegetarian or vegan. Such a diet is low in saturated fats and high in fiber and nutrients, contributing to lower rates of heart disease, obesity, hypertension, and diabetes. Common ailments that shorten life expectancy in the broader population. The emphasis on whole foods and the avoidance of processed items play a significant role in their health. Additionally, the consumption of water as the primary beverage, along with the practice of eating nuts regularly, has been associated with reduced risk of developing chronic diseases. Regular physical exercise is another pillar of the Adventist lifestyle. Whether through walking, cycling, gardening, or participating in community sports, physical activity is incorporated into daily life. This commitment to staying active helps maintain a healthy weight reduces the risk of chronic disease, and promotes overall well-being. Seventh-day Adventists abstain from smoking, alcohol, and the use of other substances harmful to health, in adherence to their belief in maintaining the body as a temple. But our body is the, the temple of God, that's what it says, you know. We are His temple. This avoidance significantly contributes to their reduced risk of cancers, liver disease, and respiratory problems, all of which are major contributors to mortality in the general population. Mental health and a strong social support system are integral to the Adventist approach to longevity. 
The community provides a network of social connections through church activities, including group meals, social gatherings, and volunteer opportunities. These activities not only foster a sense of belonging and purpose, but also provide emotional and practical support, contributing to lower stress levels and better mental health. The Adventist faith encourages a day of rest on the Sabbath, allowing time for relaxation, reflection, and reconnection with family and community. This break from the weekly routine is essential for mental health, offering a respite from the stresses of daily life. Loma Linda boasts a world-renowned medical center, emphasizing preventive care and holistic health in line with Adventist principles. The community's focus on health care not only involves treating illnesses, but also promoting healthy lifestyles to prevent diseases before they start. While the Seventh-day Adventists in Loma Linda share commonalities with other longevity zones, such as a focus on diet and physical activity, their longevity is also heavily influenced by religious beliefs that dictate lifestyle choices. This integration of faith and health practices sets them apart, providing a unique model of longevity within a modern American context.